Well, it was a pretty ignominious start with that 3-0 loss in the opener. And this is one of those situations where you realize lower leagues really are poor quality football. <laughs> but anyway, we have rebounded. We've got a couple of wins under our belt. So let's take a look at the scores. We'll have highlights against top of the table, Borumwood, And then today we are playing Farnborough. So let's get into it. Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back to Play the Kids, our football manager 21 youth challenge and director of football challenge. This is episode two. Uh, as you can see, after the first uh, match of the season, 3-0 loss, we beat Infield Town 2-0. Uh, a pair of penalties. Uh, McCauley got sent off with a double yellow card in that one in the 23rd minute. Luckily, we were able to hold on and they had a player sent off with uh, with a, a second yellow red uh, in the 62nd minute, and we converted two penalties by Graham Williams for the win. And then we beat Welling 4-2. Graham Williams scored again. That was our first goal of the season from the field. <laughs> it was crazy. They had a player sent off in the 74th minute, and we scored two goals after that. Uh, Bliss Cotterill, Grant Wilkins, and Tim Cook with the goals in the second half there, and we won 4-2. to two. So right now, heading into today's episode, we are currently sixth in the table with six points from three. So we're going to call that a victory. We're doing very well from how we started. But man, we're, we're, we're seeing players sent off every single match. All right, we are playing Borum Wood. Let me get that one played, and we'll be right back with highlights. Well, they dominated this one 14 shots to five or seven. I don't remember. But uh, McCauley takes a crack from the edge of the box, and that was a cracker to give us a 1-0 advantage. In the 40th minute, Borum Wood over the top. I'm sorry, that was our play. Williams puts that in to give us a 2-0 advantage. Prattley would get a set piece that just bounced off the keeper, got deflected off a defender, and Owusu puts it into the net. Colbert, Corbett to McCann. There's a nice ball into Cook down in the corner. A good square, and Williams goes up for the header. Makes it 3-1 in the 84th minute and we would hold on. They had a player sent off. Uh, I'm sorry, we had a player sent off in the 47th minute of stoppage time, Sloan with a second yellow card, and then they had Joshua Owusu was sent off uh, it with a straight red in the 76th minute, but you can see they dominated us on shots two to one, but we made the most of our chances. Sloan on his debut, uh, the 20-year-old left back, and he got sent off. So he'll be suspended. Williams with another two-goal match. So he is our goal-scoring leader and looking really good there. Taking a look, we have a very, very small squad, and we've been unable to sign anybody, anybody. So we're going to have to – it's going to be a rough season. And I, we've had four or five players that we've offered contracts to but none of them have come on board, and then we lost a handful of players. So we're going to continue looking, but let me get up to the next match for Farnborough, and we will play that one out here on camera. So today we play Farnborough. We're going to go with Murphy and goal, Bea, Corbett, Frazier, and McCauley on the back line. McCann at the base of the central mid, Wilkins and White on the wings, Evans in the number 10, and a striker pairing of Cook and Williams. We at least have a full bench today as people are coming back from suspensions. They're unhappy at getting played out of position. Not a lot I can do about that. We'll give them a shout for early encouragement. And I think we just killed a highlight with that. So that was interesting. And a yellow card to Corbett in the 11th minute. So we are already off to a great start. Of course, they picked up a yellow in the second minute. A lot of yellow cards, man. Hopefully, as we, if, if we progress up levels, hopefully we get a little bit better here. 
We are in the gold uniform, the gold kits today. That was not a good clearance across. There's a shot. Murphy got a hand on it, and then it's put put up into the stands. I don't know why he didn't clear it to the side, but this is lower league management. The header goes up in the stands. We'll take the goal kick from that one. Not a whole lot going on. We picked up a couple more yellow cards. Evans with the set piece. It's cleared away. Frazier went the wrong way. Brown is on a break. He's got Tompkins coming with him. He laid it off, but the uh, winger looks like he cut inside. Oh, there's a nice ball. Cook controls it. And he sends it wide of the mark. Oh, that has got to be a finish. It's got to be a finish. Come on. Oh, I, I really think fatigue is going to become a major issue as we progress here because we have such a small squad. It's just going to be really hard to keep these guys fit for matches. I can see later in the season. Oh, uh, look at that. Kenny Williams went right past our center back tandem. Oh, and we are in a 1-0 hole. Uh, Wilkins is nursing an injury, a potential knee injury. Uh, let's see. So if we put him, I don't have anybody. We can bring Woodhouse on. No, let's bring uh, Bliss Cotterill in. Yeah, let's do that. I actually like him. I think he's one of our better players, but he's an attacking winger, not a central mid winger. Uh, let's uh, demand more. Murphy lumps it out. There's Bliss Cotterill up to Cook. Over the top, Bliss Cotterill on the run, and he goes near post for his second goal of the season. Get in there, boy. And there's an equalizer for us in the 58th minute. Do we want to make another sub here? I don't think so. The problem is we are so thin, I can't even make I can't even make subs for guys like McCann that are just looking shit. Nothing I can do there. I'm noticing a lot of clubs have strike. Oh my god. Okay, that was on Williams. Thank you. No, what the hell? Hold on. Where's Williams? Williams is on their team. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I thought that was a foul. Oh, what a save by Murphy. That's the second penalty we've seen him save. Remember that first, uh, first match? He had a huge save. All right, that one's headed out. Cook runs on to it. Bea throws it right to their player. All right, Cook lays it into White. He tries to cross it. Not very good. Williams with the header and goes high. All right, come on. We could do a little bit better. Let's encourage. No, can't encourage him yet. All right, Bea drops it in. It's Bliss Cotterell, and he scores his second of the match, and we've taken the lead here. All right, let's jump into tactics here. We're going to have to kind of work tactics a little bit more. All right, in transition, we want to slow the pace down. That's all I want to do here. Uh, out of possession, yeah, we're already back. We're already back. All right. That was a nice ball. Bea, nice through ball. Looks like Williams actually drifted to the left to clear out that run for him. So that was actually an intelligent football play. And it's Evans, set piece, back post, and it's Tim Cook. He gets his second goal of the season. We've got a few fans over here. Good. Thank you all for coming out. The Tivy Ultras. Not exactly sure. I'm sure they've got a, a fan name that they go by. But uh, 
I think the fact that they're called the Tibbies is just pretty cool. All right, that makes it three to one. All right, let's go ahead. We're going to make a su couple of subs here, if we can. So we would like to pull off Frazier, but we can't, because I don't have... Yes, I can. Hold on. I have a wing back on the right. That's McCaulish. So let's bring him into the mid, and then Frazier for Woodhouse. And then McCann... Yeah, he might be able to do the job. I want to bring him in there. All right, we'll do that. Hopefully we can hold on here. All right, Corbett heads it down. There's a nice ball to White into the box. It's squared. Was Williams on sides? Not sure. I think so. Yep, he just lumped it out. Good, so that makes it 4-1. Good ball. That was a good pass to White, and then a good, yeah. Williams was kept onside by Shaw. That was nice. Four to one, and we are going to cruise this one. Four minutes of stoppage time, and this puts us top of the table. That is an awesome, awesome result. We're going to go outstretched arms, a good win. Excellent, excellent job. All right, Wilkins is out. Hmm. All right, six to nine days. Bliss Cotterell, I think he is making a case to get into the starting rotation. Uh, he can play out there. I think I want to... I'm going to go ahead and set his training. Mid-center, uh, let's see, mid-right, winger, attack. All right, we'll do that. All right, let's take a look. Let's finish out the day real quick. Now, again, they were bottom of the table, so we have done a good job there. Uh, but four on the bounce, that is very nice. Taking a look at the squad. So it's six goals in five for Williams, three goals for Bliss Cotterell, mostly off of the bench. Again, I think he is pushing for playing time. Where is White? I mean, he's good as well. Bliss Cotterell can play all across the board, can he? So I could move White over to the left, especially with Wilkins out. So maybe that's what we do. Maybe play him as an inverted on the left side, something like that. All right, well, where do we come back at? I think uh, let's get a good run in, and we'll come back for H&W uh, for highlights, and then whoever we play in the FA Cup, that'll be our next uh, match on video. Uh, so come back for that, hit the like button, subscribe, and don't forget, stay up to date for daily football manager content here on the channel. Thanks so much, guys. Have a good one. Bye.